Hi, I'm Rob from Snow Tracks. Here to talk to you today about Never Summer Peacemaker. First thing to point out, graphic is going to change slightly on the production models. This is a sample that we've been using to ride out and test, and uh, the graphic will differ slightly. So base your decision on what you see online on the actual pictures, because that is likely to change. So out and test. A couple of the guys actually got to ride on this and I've ridden this board before so uh, let's focus on a couple of the comments that are more recent. Um, firstly, you'll probably see Paul in the clips quite a lot. Paul's been using the Peacemaker and it's one of his favourite boards for the last season or so now. He's been championing this and it works really well. Whilst this board is a full-on freestyle twin, um, that's not really where Paul rides and a lot of the qualities of the board work really well for him. It's, it's a little bit more relaxed. Um, it's quite a soft flexing snowboard. Where a lot of the carbon layup in is, is actually up and down the board. So you get a lot of pop if you're in the park when, uh, when, you, when you really float those ollies. But in terms of torsional stiffness, so we're talking about across the width of the board, it's quite forgiving. So if you're a more relaxed, probably a slightly lazy rider, this actually can work for you as well. But bear in mind that the actual profile, which is still Never Summer's more aggressive profile, kind of counteracts that when you need it. So it's a little bit like cruise control. The shape of the board um, is, uh, is quite predictable, is quite firm, but the flex is quite forgiving. So they work well together. Um, so for freestyle riders, um, you're probably going to be looking at this in the range against, uh, against the fun slinger. And your biggest difference is really where the stiffness is because in terms of stiffness they are a soft flexing board but where they've loaded the power in the fun slinger is more in the tip and tail radian radiating out um, whereas in this board it's along along the board so with the peacemaker it's unaffected for its torsional rigidity which makes it really really forgiving um, but loads of pop um, when you're launching off booters or trying to get onto, uh, onto rails compared to the fun slinger which is just a little bit more powerful in the tip and tail. Um, so those are the kind of key differences. 